Hello everyone. I'm a Dr. Mohal Banker, Interventional Radiologist from Ahmedabad. And today I'm going to discuss few facts about the varicose eczema. So what is a varicose eczema? You can see the skin changes here, the ankle region. So these are varicose eczema. Typically it develops into the varicose vein patients. Right now here also you can see these are this dilated tortuous varicose vein over here into, into this uh, low leg region. So this varicose eczema develop into this varicose vein patients and uh, typically it's a skin changes near the dependent portion near the ankle, ankle region and underlying skin and uh, is also uh, thicker and harder. So what is the cause of varicose eczema? Most common reason of varicose eczema is a varicose vein itself because of this disturbed venous circulation, deoxygenated blood remains stagnant for a long time and increased intravenous pressure in, uh, leads to the increased transmural pressure and this will lead to the varicose eczema. And uh, is it treatable? Yes, of course it's treatable. If you find out underlying root of cause and if you treat this uh, underlying the cause of this disease then definitely varicose eczema will disappear. But what happened many times that uh, because is the skin changes primary it is referred to dermatologist and dermatologist try to treat this uh, varicose eczema with routine eczematous patient and they try to apply uh, the steroid ointment to for such kind of patient. Now what happened? If the patient applies steroid ointment locally, then there is definitely anti-inflammatory effect. So for short term, patient may feel better, but underlying cause is not cured. So uh, this local ointment is just short term uh, treatment. Unless until you treat the underlying cause, varicose eczema is not going to disappear. So what should be done? Ideally, it should be referred to an interventional radiologist or any varicose vein expert. And uh, uh, once I once I uh, receive any patient of varicose eczema, I do the duplex scan. Duplex scan is an important investigation tool from which I identify which valves of this lower limb are leaked or damaged. Identify the valves and according to that treatment should be planned. And uh, for conservative treatment, stocking is the best option. Stocking will reduce the intravenous pressure. So uh, it helps to reverse for varicose eczematous condition. And uh, into, into the duplex scanning, if the main valves are leak, like a saphenofuel junction or saphenopopular junction, then endovenous thermal ablation should be planned. And uh, if there's a perforator are leak, then foam slow therapy should be planned. So varicose eczema is definitely curable. If you treat underlying cause, then varicose eczema will disappear. And many patients ask me, what if I don't get treated? It's very important question. There are six stages of varicose vein disease and the varicose eczema appears into the fourth stage. What happened if you don't treat uh, varicose eczema in this stage, then a later on infected ulcer will develop and patient will suffer a lot. So whenever the varicose eczema develop, it's already advanced varicose vein disease and it should be treated with the endovenous thermal ablation and foam scale therapy. Thank you so much. Hope you have enjoyed this video and uh, for more information, you can visit my website.